Greetings, salutations. Welcome back to another one of Back Down Skis Out of the Park 23 Perfect Team No Money Spent videos. I am Bat Downski back from the city. I went to Toronto with some friends of mine, met up, watched some Blue Jays baseball over the weekend. They dropped two of three to the Twins, but two out of three games were pretty damn entertaining to see. Like uh, Friday, I'm going to skip over. You never like to get smacked around by Chi Chi Gonzalez. And uh, that roster, like Kyle Garlic, who is that? I, I We were in the outfield. I wanted to yell at Kyle Garlic, kind of give it to him, you know, like, that Homer Simpson, garlic. But, like, the dude had already hit two home runs before I got my first beer. Like, geez. Can't give it to the guy if he's got having a career heater, right? Uh, but that was, it was pretty good. Saturday, uh, Jose Barrios uh, had, like, a, just an absolute whack of strikeouts. Best game of his career, and that was really cool to be able to see that. And yell at Angel Hernandez. So, like, everything was coming up for us. And then Sunday was super entertaining. We were uh, hanging out again, I want to say up the third baseline, and Matt Chapman was putting on a show, and there was a late comeback, and it, it, was, it, was, it was a lot of fun. But uh, let's get to some out of the park, shall we? Here. Here we are indeed. We are still in Gold League. I haven't been demoted yet. I've been unsuccessful at getting demoted. Haven't been adding any improvements, but my defense is just too damn strong. And I'm opening so many packs from winning tournaments that... Um, yeah, <laughs> but uh, our roster looks pretty much the same. We're getting a great season out of Newt Allen, stealing a ton of bases. He's getting on base. He's pacing for like four wins. It's nice to see. Carlos Gomez not having a great year. Bob Bailey's doing good though. Like it's nice to see Bob Bailey bounce back after that one really bad season. But uh, he's doing good. Don Mattingly is uh, not. <laughs> Uh, Cunha is playing, went really well, which is, oh, wow, he got bumped to 100. No? Maybe? Looks like he's at 100. We're kind of in between here, right? Uh, Wander Franco has been all right as a third baseman. He's been a little bit better with the glove than Bailey was, and he's been fine. We're still having a big hole in right field. Like, Suzuki's not really cutting the mustard, and George Springer hasn't stepped up either. Uh, catcher, Real Mudo's not really doing so good for us either. Um, yeah. Francisco Lindor. Not super happy with that. Like, I might have to go back to Cardenas or something. Like, he played kind of better. Like, he hit better at a 79 than uh, <laughs> Lindor does at a 99. So that's uh, that's plenty interesting. But, like, oh, never mind. I take it back. George Springer coming around as uh, he's been bumped. He's been, he was really good in Toronto. Like, uh, watching him, really fun player. Plus the uh, the old lady I was sitting beside, uh, she was a delight, and she, that was her favorite player. So <laughs> can't go wrong with George Springer. Uh, I added Emmanuel Class Clasha Clase to uh, the team because he was coming up strong, and so we shuffled our bullpen around a little bit. But for the most part, it's the same kind of uh, group of characters we've had for a few years. I'm still using this David Phelps card as kind of a low leverage middle reliever, and it's. Um, it's working better for me than it has any right to. <laughs> the pitching has been carrying for me this season. Uh, Billy Gullickson is good. Dizzy Dean is uh, real good. Bob Steele somehow punches above his weight. Uh, Jack Leiter is uh, not so good this season, but like he's, he's in there so many of those years. And Zach Wheeler uh, bouncing back a little bit. He's having a good year. He's at 100 now, so that's, that's cool. That being said, what do we think? So open some packs. Just a big nothing burger. I remember Joel Pamps. That's a waiver playing pitcher if I've ever seen one. I don't know, Vino. Okay. I can live with that. Like I'll, I'll take that. Some all right cards in here, like some of these guys. Like I, I doubt I'll use this guy, but maybe 59 in an iron league. Might be an okay ground ball, worm killer type in a... Okay, like honestly, I'm really looking for just like somebody to bring the bar up on my team or uh, useful cards for bronze and iron. Uh, I think Seashick is okay. And, uh, and history, I want a lot of historical cards. 
I'll take that. Future Legends are good too. Uh, that's like another Brocius. I have like three of these. And I just got that one. So not the best group to get, but like this is nice. Michael Bush, I'll take that. Sad Sam Jones. That's about it there. Rich Folkers, that's another double. Bunch, bunch of Oakland Athletics, so you know things are going good for me. Sixto Sanchez, I can do that. I can. I'm, I'm good with that. That's a nice pit. That's a nice pull. Uh, Ken Brett, another kind of card I don't have. He might be useful in that uh, meta. I, I haven't quite figured out the bronze yet, but I'm getting there. Travis Demaret still pretty all right in the iron. I wouldn't use this guy. Not good enough at defense. So use a shortstop. Maybe he's an okay second baseman. Corey Hart. Okay. Okay. I saw that I had Tyler Duffy there. Tyler Duffy almost blew the game on Sunday. <laughs> They'd already used Duran, who uh, is, is like pretty, he got through an inning with like eight pitches. And uh, he did get whacked by a uh, comeback or off the mound, and then it was kind of like, oh, I wonder if he'll stay in, because he's only throwing eight, and then they took him out, I guess. He used Duffy, and it didn't work amazing. Jeremy Burnitz. A Strasburg. Okay. <laughs> this uh, Hunter Renfro makes me laugh because of that whole Blake Snell thing. Oh man, we traded Fab for a Renfro and a slapdick. Incredible. That's that's a, that's a real that's real reaction right there. He later apologized to the players involved. He's just sad about losing Fab, which like yeah, I get it. Renfro was way too good for the Red Sox though. Like he was he actually has been a fairly good player since that trade. Mike Clevinger. Not bad. I'm like, honestly, I'll take some of this as well because I'm also still. He can be okay in Iron League as well, Johnny Padres. Um, I'm still trying to. Uh, no, it's gone. My chain of thought. I still got. I've got missions to complete. So getting like any of these that I don't have is actually like helpful in me getting more packs and more cards. That seems fun. We'll take a look at that a little bit later, perhaps. Ooh, Seinfeld people know. <laughs> Let's see, nothing really here. That seems okay for a really year. Okay, Mike Messina. That's a duplicated one I already got. I got excited. I was like, that's a build a legend. Nope, last year. Last year it was. Dalbeck, Marwin. He's really good as a kind of um, everyman, like utility guy. And, uh, Ooh, Brett Phillips. I know he plays this game. <laughs> There's a couple of players that we, it's just knowing that they play out of the park. It's kind of fun. It's like, yeah, this guy might be playing some out of the park right now and later going and playing a game, like an actual game of baseball. Oh, here we go. I'll take that. Joe Musgrove has been exceptional this season. One of the best five pitchers in the majors right now. So, like, that's, I think that could get better even. That's it. That's a keeper. Putting that in my top pocket and buttoning it. That's nice. Okay. To Oscar. He lost one of the sun and it was super frustrating and I was kind of mad about it because it was two outs that they could have gotten Gosman, he and Vlad if they'd only, you know, worn sunglasses. And uh, no, nah, didn't happen. And then I played actual baseball last night and lost it in the lights and went, okay, <laughs> okay. That's not nearly as easy as it looks. <laughs> he, he's, his bat is heating up, though, so I'd expect him to get a little bit better. 
back to where it was. Oh, here we go. I like Stephen Kwan a lot. Good defense, like good contact skills, back to ball. Like, I like Stephen Kwan. I think Bruton uh, has a lot. Like, he's versatile. He runs fast. Like, there's there's elements of him. He's a real good athlete. I like this guy. There's a good chance. I might be using an iron. If he's only a 58, I might put him on my Iron League teams just to get some bench running. Some people that can steal some bases off the bench and play a bunch of positions. Like, that's not bad. I already have a Trevino. Really good defensively. Ortega. Roy Moore. I've seen some people use this guy. I think he's more of a relief type in that uh, Iron League meta, but I might actually use that. That's not bad. Sosa, glove first uh, infielder. Stoltz. Okay. Oh, here we go. Hell yeah. Uh, Brett Anderson is a nice ground ball pitcher. Like, that's a, he's lefty, he's a ground ball pitcher, he's got good stamina, like, he's gonna go deep in the games with that, and like, that's that's a nice card to pull. I'm happy about that. John Birdie's fun, too, because he's really fast. So, like, this was a good pack to open. I got a silver, too. I didn't even notice that I had Dallas Keuchel. But, uh, here we are. Oh, yeah. Chris Sale. Makes a motion. I'm gonna sell it. It's a duplicate, and... Can't be bothered to like Chris Sale. When he played for the White Sox, he cut up vintage uniforms. Like, he was like, no, I don't want to wear that. And then he cut them up. Like, that's that's some big loser energy. <laughs> I think that was part of why he got traded, actually. That and cost savings, naturally. This guy's all right. He's a ground ball pitcher. Like for a 52, not bad. He's got like seven pitches. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Yashoka, um, for whatever reason, seems to hit against the Jays, and I don't like it. <laughs> oh no, Syndergaard has fallen on some rough times here. Um, I pulled this as a gold a couple weeks ago, so seeing me pull a 66 of him is uh, not my favorite thing. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, yes. I can live that I just got a double of a diamond, but, like, that is a coup. Like, Ray Brown's excellent. That's an excellent card to pull. He's going to be worth a lot of points in my uh, missions for that, uh, for the Negro League Stars. So I'm stoked to get that. That's awesome. I'm very happy. <laughs> Let's open our last pack. It's a history one. Spires. Dietrich. Larton. That looks like a reliever to me. A good reliever, but a reliever. Ewing that I've gotten for 14 times. Cabrera. Hensley. There we go. I think there were a couple that I said I'd take a look at with you. Oh my, that's so many cards. That's the downside of um, <laughs> saving them up to open on a, uh, a video, is that there's so many cards there. Just some, it's wild. I wish there was a select, oh, there's a select all. The problem being is that I actually want to keep some of my cards here for observation. Or else I would clearly do that, right? I just want to make sure that I'm keeping a few cards for observation uh, to kind of see where they're going. If they're, especially the live cards, like some of them I keep just in case, like there's somebody on the roster. Then I'm like, okay, I can't do, I can't look at this guy anymore. So I keep a couple cards in reserve to swap in if uh, necessary, or if I want to change how I'm going to play the game. So I've got a couple of those, right? And then. Uh, Yeah, here, Ortega, Keuchel, Dobnik, Ashby, Burke, Hauser, Stamina. Well, that's the Papal Bond, the build a lineup. It's okay. Okay. Ozzy Albies, 
Taylor, Strasburg, Clevenger, Trevino. I've got Taylor Ward. Uh, the funny story there is that I, I was like, oh yeah, that Taylor Ward guy's raking. And then I bought a Tyler, uh, <laughs> a Tyler Wade card. <laughs> Attention to detail isn't necessarily my thing. <laughs> It's like this. This is going up. I can't believe he's still an iron. And he was the wrong dude. Oh, good times. I've since kind of figured it out, right? Like I obviously was like, oh, I got the wrong guy, and then I got the appropriate player. But it was uh, a little embarrassing at the time. And throw a George Springer back. Alvarez has really taken off. He wasn't very good for me. Like, I threw him away after that. So that I could use um, Wander Franco, who's been okay. I don't know that I made the right decision there, but um, yeah, I'm going to be shifting some things around, probably bringing in Frank Tanana. It's a fun name, but um, yeah, Stephen Kwan, very good. Very good left fielder. I like him a lot. What was the other one I said I'd show? Vita Blue, I got this. Yeah. That seems fun. Michael Bush. Yeah, just a good all-rounder. I, I don't think he's a second baseman. Like, that's probably a first baseman. I won't use this. But it's nice to have. This is an all right one, Jamie Moyer. I remember this dude's pitched until he was like 400 years old. It was good. Bobby Gritch I just got. I haven't looked at Bobby Gritch. Yeah, see, that's okay. I would I would play with that in silver. It's not like I have a whack of better options available to me. I thought about using uh, Sammy Sosa, but like he can only play right field or center, and he's uh, his defense is brutal. Hard sell. Hard sell on uh, using him. Like Larry Walker would be better to use. Oops. Should have turned my phone off. I'm a professional, damn it. Um, Jonathan Papelbon. But yeah, there's a couple of the cards that I got. Let's, oh, that's the wrong guy. Let's take a look at Sixto. Yeah, let's see, that's what I, I like it. Ground ball or throws hard, has some pitches. Not bad, not bad at all. Are there better cards? Absolutely. Like, I would kind of, I think this might be a little bit better, even though the number doesn't say it is. But, uh, yeah. There we go. We've opened some cards. We opened 32 packs of cards. And, uh, yeah, I made it back from the city alive. I'm here. I'm much poorer, but it was a good time. And uh, if you get a chance to catch some baseball live this season and it's safe to do so, then make it happen. Like it, it's really, it's one of those sports where it just gets that much better watching it in person instead of on the TV. So, uh, thanks for joining me. We'll uh, be back with some more content probably later this week as I build up more cards to open and uh, some more hot takes on where the Met is going in iron or bronze leagues. And uh, as always, like and subscribe. There's something of a bell. I don't know. I, this is what I'm supposed to say, right? Like, subscribe. To help me make content, yada, yada, yada. But honestly, leave a comment below. If um, Tell me about some of your baseball park experiences. <laughs> if you've seen any real good games or any incredible plays, anything you've seen live that was just like next level. And uh, as always, have a great day.